Today we're at Rick Ware Racing and with their newest driver, Kaz Grala, as he prepares for your first race with the team coming at the uh, Clash at the Coliseum in Los Angeles this weekend. How excited are you to get this season started off? Oh, I can't wait. And I got to tell you, this came up quick, didn't it? The Clash uh, being two weeks before Daytona really shortens the off season, I feel like. So I'm so excited to get out there. I can't believe it's already race week. I feel like feel like our number 15 Ford Mustang is going to be pretty good. We, we've been happy in the sim, and Billy and I have been working well together so far. So um, just excited to get, get working with these guys, get the season underway. Is the plan to, to try to cobble together a complete season? I mean, right now you got all but 10 races. Yeah, I mean, that I mean that, that really wasn't the plan, but it seems to be maybe slowly inching up towards that. Um, I know I think I'm in the first 10 or 11 races consecutively. So I don't know. I don't know what the future will hold, but um, I do know if, if we go win any of these races early, then I'm going to have to try to scrap and figure out how to find rides the rest of the year. Right. So um, I'm hoping to cause that problem for myself. Are you declaring as a, a cup driver? Because I know you have to do that at the beginning of the season. Yeah, for points, uh, I'll be scoring points in the Cup Series. Um, as far as Rookie of the Year, I don't think I'm declared for that since I'm not racing full time. Um, so we'll just, you know, we'll take it one race at a time. But 25 races with these guys here at Rick Ware Racing, I feel like is a, a great opportunity for me. It should give me plenty of time to build chemistry with the team and that communication that's so important, you know, especially in the Cup Series. You're up against guys that obviously are racing full time, but maybe have been with that same team and crew chief for six years, eight years, 10 years. So um, it's tough to come in part time for sure, but at least 25 races will, will give me a fighting chance and, and give me a good rhythm for the season. I think we're gonna work really well together and um, it, it helps that we're kind of coming in here at the same time, brand new experiencing uh, this team uh, for the first time together. And you know we'll be able to brainstorm with each other, bounce ideas back and forth about what we feel like we have as strengths and, and what we can work on to get better. And so. Um, I, I think the 51 team is, is going to be a, a really good help for the program here. Having a, a full-time driver, a little consistency there for them, uh, I think is going to be great. And then I'll be fairly consistent in the 15 car. So I, I think we'll be able to work, work together and hopefully move, move the program forward to where we want it to be. Well, you speak about moving the, the program forward. And if you look over the last five years or so, I mean, every year you can see the, the progression of where we're racing. So, I know you guys have got to be excited that, that you can get up and, and contend for wins this year. Yeah, I think so. And the, the next gen car has certainly been a big help as far as leveling the, the playing field a little bit. You know, you look you look back five years ago and the guys that were finishing in the bottom five positions were 10 laps down, 12 laps down in a cup race. Now you're getting to the point where most cars are lead lap. Um, you know, if you're on a mile and a half, there might be a couple cars a lap down, but for the most part, everybody's got a chance out there. So um, I feel like that's that's right where RWR was last year on the tail end of that lead lap, which gives you the opportunity to capitalize on those positions late in the race. Where everything's trending for this year, I think the team's gonna be a little bit better than that. And and so that means we're gonna be up in the fight. We're gonna be in that that mid pack and on good days, maybe, maybe further than that, maybe in the top 10, uh, I feel like is a reasonable possibility. So. Um, you know, everyone here has been working really hard through the off season, really trying to maximize everything. So um, I like what I see. I like what they're putting into uh, the program here. I feel like they're doing all the right things. So um, it's up to Justin and I now to, to figure out how to squeeze the most out of it and get these things where, where they belong. Okay, well, thank you for uh, taking a few minutes for us today. And as he said, it all starts this weekend out in Los Angeles, the clash at the Coliseum. You'll be able to watch Kaz in the 15 car.